Hello, everybody, and welcome back to XCOM Enemy Within with me, Burgo. What is up, everybody? We tried to, uh, we took down a UFO uh, last time down here in Brazil, uh, where the base is located, and that was absolutely fantastic. It was a flawless mission. No casualties reported, only alien deaths recorded. And we, uh, we tried to advance, advance the days a little bit, but, uh, unfortunately there's some alien abductions going on. We decided to head to San Francisco, United States, to try and bolster our engineering core, uh, so we can get some satellites up and produced just a bit quicker. And you know what? Before we go on this mission, let's head down there and make sure... Do we have, like, facilities going? Yeah, we do. We've got a power generator up. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and build an access lift here. Uh, that way we can build a satellite uplink here in order to link it all up. Let's see if we've got any items for sale. Let's get a med kit. That'd be good. Um, and, man, that's really going to put us close to budget, though. Only ten bucks. Let's go ahead and manufacture a another satellite here. Let's do a bit of buying and selling. We don't need all these sectoid corpses right now. Um, and we can really get rid of this stuff, um, because we aren't, we aren't going to be researching that right away. Um, but let's head back to Mission Control, let's head to San Francisco, um, with our team of Shelby Gardner, Antoine Laud, Renard LeBlanc, and Tom Bender. Looking good here. Let's give, uh, Shelby Gardner a med kit, uh, so she can actually act as a support, <coughs> support class. A sniper support heavy assault. Looking good. All squatties, but uh, not, not, really not too bad of a team. So let's go ahead and get moving, guys. Let's launch the mission. Hopefully you don't run into too much trouble. Let's just try and play it, play it well. Collected all the meld last time. We're doing quite well with that. I think we have 40 meld now. We have visual on so. the mission site. Setting down. All right, let's go ahead and begin the assault. Get ready to deploy. Our AO is within the continental United States. Thanks, Bradshaw. Any other information Alien for us? Activity ah. Continues to surge within several major <clears throat> cities. Our response is crucial to minimizing the spread of panic. Right. Okay. Mission objectives neutralize all hostile targets. Locate and secure meld canisters. Operation Bleeding Sentinel is a go. Let's go. And we're going to San Francisco. <laughs> all right. Let's do a quick bit of observation here. One meld canister was located over here before the fog of war took our line of sight on that away. But uh, at least we know where it is, so now we can get down to business. Antoine Lot, have you an overall overwatch? Let's go ahead and move up Renard here. Get him positioned up on a car. Not a lot of full cover uh, to be using here. Tom Benner, let's have you move on up, buddy. Have you switched to the Pistolo because it's a bit more useful. Um, in overwatch situations that require a bit more distance. Let's have Shelby go off in this way, cover our left flank. Have her hit overwatch as well. LeBlanco, right there, that should be good. <coughs> See if any aliens decide to join us here at this. Looks like, an, uh, looks like a bank, yeah, yeah, yeah. Got 24 hour ATM. Give me your pin number so I can access your cash so we can buy more stuff for the XCOM project. Miss Gardner, let's have you move up. Expand our line of sight. We're going to have you start moving over that meld canister. Hmm, what else do we want to do here? Bender, we're going to have you move from alien drop pod to drop pod. So we've got two sectoids here. Shouldn't be too much of a problem, depending on where they go anyway. And one guy just chilling out there. What do we got? 50% to hit. Also another 50%. How much movement? Let's have uh, Renard LeBlanc move on over here. Let's see if we can establish a bit of a line of sight. Kind of want to take it easy here, though. How do we want to do this? We can grenade this. Uh, yeah, we can, because once we throw our grenade there, we can blow up that car. I'm not sure if I'm entirely comfortable doing that, though. Let's take a 50% chance. See if we can get some damage on him. Yeah, we got a shot on him. We got a couple bullets dug into him. <clears throat> Let's move Antoine Lot up, get him in some cover here. Slip him to his pistol as well. We'll get him in Overwatch. Let's have Shelby move on over here. 
Hopefully there's no alien reinforcements on that flank. Come here, sectoid boy, what do you got? Activating our overwatch here. LeBlanc with the kill on the reaction shot. Beautiful work, my beautiful Canadian friend. Let's see what the other sectoids got for us. You wanna join the party as well? Not so much. It's fine by me. Bender, let's have you move on up. We'll pursue this guy a little bit here. We're gonna have you take it a bit easy though. Why don't you go ahead and move up to that ATM there. Skarner. Have you continue advancing? We're gonna have you stick to the full cover though. I think that'll be very good. Maintain a little bit of a line of sight there. Getting a little risky in the plays. <clears throat> what do we want to do with Antoine? Let's have Antoine actually cover a little bit. Have him move over to this drop pod and get him in an overwatching position. Bernard LeBlanc, we're gonna have you entering the building. Let's have you dash on up there. Get a line of sight into that bank and see what we got rocking and rolling. <clears throat> okay, a couple more sectoids entering the building here. Depending on where they decide to move to, we may actually be able to use an explosive device to take out both of these targets. Let's go ahead and open this door, though. Alright, what do we got for shots? 47%, 47%. Let's see what we can do with a rocket here. Can we hit both of them with this? I believe so. Shot is blocked though. So where can we hit him? We can hit 90% with that. Let's go ahead and take that shot. Let's blow these fools up. <coughs> Bam! Looks like we missed that one though. That's unfortunate. Bit of a waste, but at least one of them's down, right? Let's see if we can get a shot on one with Antoine. Should be far enough away. Should be able to get a decent shot. 55%. Not the best. I can get half cover up there and we can probably get a grenade on him. Um. Heading to that location. Let's go and do this. Totally didn't mean to send him in there, but the point will be. The point will be all the same. Let's go and send a grenade over there. Enjoy your final moments. Have a nice life. All right, he's down. Let's go and secure this meld because that is very important. <clears throat> Ten meld collected. I don't even know where the other canister is, so that's a bit of a problem. So you got quite a bit left to this map. Let's go and rotate around here. Switch to our shotgun. Let's have him, Tom better move up onto this window. Oh my word, oh dear. Okay, well we've got sights on them. Let's hope they stay a bit closer together so we can take them all out. Looks like they're gonna do just that, so that is perfect. Let's take the old three for one deal. That's pretty good. Pretty good value for a grenade, actually. So let's toss that in there. Enjoy your potatoes, my friends. Have a nice life. Three for the price of one. Can't go wrong. <clears throat> Chalk up another one. Did very well on that one. Operation Bleeding Sentinel. Six aliens killed. Zero XCOM operatives lost, two to mail the canisters collected. Fantastic, let's go ahead and continue on our quest for glory. And on back to Brazil here. <clears throat> what do we got, Sky Ranger Patrol? Let's get the report. I'm impressed you were able to recover so much of the melt substance without any casualties. I'm pretty impressed by myself as well, uh, Dr. Valen. Fortunately, no one was promoted. That's a bit surprising. Urban Combat Badge is now unlocked. Visit the Barracks of Destiny. It's a special capability for this medal and reward it and award it to a soldier. Awesome. New facility available. Workshop. Really good stuff. It basically boosts the productivity of our engineers. Four more engineers added to the staff. <clears throat> that is excellent. Commander. You can now honor our soldiers by awarding them medals for accomplishments you deem appropriate. Okay, Bradshaw. View and award medals in the barracks. Excellent. Let's go ahead and check that out. Medals. Urban Combat Badge. Let's assign a power. Plus five aim against enemies in full cover. Plus five defense while in cover. That is really good. We're going to go ahead and assign that. Um, but I don't want to award it to anyone yet. I think we're going to award that to like our first sergeant. I think that would be good. Be nice. Nice leadership medal there. 
I'm still having a hard time grasping what it is the aliens are hoping to accomplish. They're trying to have a party, Dr. Valen. Chill, us? man. Why abduct humans seemingly, seemingly at random? random? Oh, there's no pattern. There's no hidden meaning. Let's go ahead and scan for activity, get set up for our next mission. Alien materials research project is complete. Let's go ahead and assign new research. Inno fiber vest available for manufacture. That is fantastic because that is a really, really good. Um, spend almost a month researching Carabas armor. Let's not worry about that. Um, let's go ahead and start on meld recombination. That'd be good. This technology that way we can start working on it. Applications. All right, let's go and start scanning, see what else we can get done here. Quest from Mexico, satellite, one satellite requested. What do we get, 200 bucks for that thing? That's actually not a bad deal. Because you spend like 100 bucks to get a satellite in a few days for 200 bucks, that's not half bad. But we'll get that figured out. Satellite operational over Argentina. Our construction uh, for our lift is complete. Let's go ahead and get this area excavated so we can get another satellite uplink facility up and running here in the next couple days. See so we can get this meld recombination done. Ooh, cutscene I haven't seen before. Let's watch. So, what is it, Doctor? It's remarkable. The crystalline structure housed within the canister is actually a suspension containing billions of cybernetic nanomachines, each made up of both organic and mechanical components. My team's analysis indicates these microscopic robots are capable of assembling mechanical structures with unprecedented efficiency. With further study and some specialized facilities, we may be able to engineer a sort of cyber suit that interfaces with the human body. My team is more interested in the possibility of physically altering the tissue itself, incorporating aspects of the alien's own genetic adaptations by using the nanites to fuse the foreign material. The commander will have to decide where the greatest advantage lies. Is there anything you agree on? Given the apparent purpose of the nanites, they allow combining organic materials with one another, or with machines. We have at least agreed to call them Meld. Awesome, awesome. Let's go ahead and assign a new research project. Apparently, this unlocks our genetic altering. Um, so we can just add all this stuff. This is fantastic. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> Mech one warden. That is sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Okay. Let's go and get another facility building. I think we're going to go first with the cybernetics lab just because that is so freaking cool. Um, well, let's go ahead and get back to scanning. Once again, just getting set up. Set up for our next mission here. Cybernetics lab should be done soon. And let's actually... Let's get a mech trooper set up. I believe we'll have that option now. <coughs> All right, that's just showing the setup is complete. The soldiers who volunteer for mech trooper augmentation sacrifice much, but they do not leave themselves entirely behind. A mech trooper will be able to apply some of the training and knowledge from his or her previous combat specialty to the cyber suits operation. Awesome. All right, let's go and augment a soldier and see what this is all about. Mechanized exoskeletal cyber suits, or <coughs> mechs, and implant our soldiers with the cybernetic interfaces they'll need to deploy these mechs onto the battlefield. All right. So from what I've actually been reading, and I've been playing around with a little bit, um, assault is actually the best, uh, in my opinion, the best um, option to go with this because I mean they're all up in your face anyway. So we're going to put Tom Bender through the grinder, <laughs> quite literally, um, when we get this bad boy mech suit. So let's go and do this. Let's augment our soldier. Ten bucks, ten meld. Getting shock absorbent armor for the assault ability. Damage received from enemies within four tiles is reduced by 33%. That is absolutely amazing. 
So let's go ahead and augment the soldier. Consult with Dr. Valand for the requisite amputations and begin installing the cybersuit interfaces as soon as possible. Awesome. All right, let's go ahead and start scanning. Hopefully, Commander, our oh. satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your order. Excellent. All right, let's go ahead and carry on scanning. Hopefully, we can get this augmentation done before our next mission. Request from North America. Oh no, we didn't. Commander. Oh mother. Several reported abductions via the hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. All right, let's take a look at what we got here. We got a new assault sergeant from Nigeria. Mexico City. Panic is all around easy here. I think we're going to go to France because we really want to bolster our scientists. We got plenty of money. We don't really need more soldiers at the moment. Uh, as we're going to be getting a mech trooper here in a couple days. But I think we're going to head to Marseille, France. And I think we're going to call it a day there, guys. I'm going to get another subscriber um, that would like to be part of the team. Uh, information input. We're going to get him customized. Him or her customized. Um, and then we will rejoin you in the next video, my friends. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit the like button. And as always, if you're not already subscribed, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Thank you again for watching. We'll see you next time.